wonderful. Yes, sir. Good afternoon, Rajmu. Sri Kang from Magal of Telugu News. We maja bari atna bari budget to shirmal this na. Expected output cost me mere bari budget change kund na ra. Did the film fit into the budget? Is the question for everyone? Yeah. Yeah. Hello. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah. See, we don't yeah. select a, a high budget movie. You can't select a movie like that. We select a story, and the uh, and the premise of the story, the the requirement of the story, tells us how much budget that is required to make the movie. So, if it's a if it's a big premise, if it has a big setups, if it has big action sequences, visual effects that needs to tell the story, obviously the budget is going to be big. So we can't go and select. Okay, let's make it make a big budget movie. It doesn't happen like that. So even being said that the interval sequence, from what I've gathered, sixty-five days, sixty-five nights actually, and every day, if I'm I'm correct me if I'm wrong, every day used to cost seventy-five lakhs. Yeah. Initial uh, initially, then uh, <laughs> then I started <laughs> tightening the screws a little bit, and we started bringing down. I need to look after my producer too. <laughs> வணக்கம் சார் நான் வந்து ரேடியோ கில்லி ஒன் சிக்ஸ் பாயிண்ட் ஃபைவ் எஃப்எம்ல இருந்த ஆர் ஜே கிருஷ் மிகப்பெரிய லெஜன்ஸ் முன்னாடி ஒரு கேள்வி கேட்கறது கொஞ்சம் தயக்கமாக இருந்தாலும் இந்த கேள்வியை கேட்டே ஆகணும் நான் ஃபஸ்ட்டு கேள்வி வந்து நம்ம ஹீரோஸ் கிட்ட தான் சார் இந்த படத்தில் அந்த ப்ரொமோ பா அந்த ட்ரெய்லர் பார்க்கும்போது அந்த அந்த வாட்ருக்கு அடியில் ஒரு ஓடுற ஒரு சீன் பார்த்தோம் மிரண்டு போயிட்டோம் ஸோ இந்த மாதிரியான சீன்ஸ் நிறைய இருக்கும் படத்தில் அப்படின்னு நினைக்கிறோம் ஸோ ஒய் வி கமிட்டட் திஸ் மூவி அப்படின்னு சொல்லி நம்ம இதுக்கு இந்த மாதிரி மூவிக்கு இனிமேல் மட்டும் கமிட் ஆக கூடாது அப்படின்னு ஏதாவது ஒரு சந்தர்ப்பம் வந்துச்சா உங்களுக்கு நடிக்கும் போது I Maybe should have gotten should, out of this. Yeah, <laughs> I should have gotten out of this. Out of this. Well, see, when you when you work with a director called Raj Mauli, you're pretty committed in your head. You know it's going to take time. Well, it's 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 what he is and that's how, you know, it 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 takes time to deliver Bahubali, right? It took its time. And again, yeah, to deliver Tripla it takes its time. 65 nights for one interval sequence which is probably about 20 to 25 minutes. 20 25 minutes you're shooting that for 65 nights so that's the kind of commitment an actor needs to have when you're working with a director called rajmo like rajmo so there was never a point where we thought you know what i think we did a mistake by committing to this but no the 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 end goal where we wanted to go was very clear in our heads because we are going to be a part of something phenomenal called triple r at the end of the day and somewhere a lot of them will remember us because we've started this lost glory of indian cinema of having two stars you know making a multi starer so that was our you know very clear in our heads we knew where we were going we knew what we got into it was pretty clear thank you thank you so much sir arthi rajamouli sir straight a tamil la indha maadhiriyana brahmandamana sila padangal neenga eppa kudukka poringa நிறைய வாட்டு சொல்லிட்டு இருக்கேங்க எனக்கு வந்து அப்படியே நான் பிரிக்கணும்னு இல்லை இல்லை தேவையில்லை தமிழ் தெலுங்கு ஹிந்தி மலையாளம் அப்படி என்னை பிரிக்கக்கூடாது மொழி வந்து சும்மா நம்ம நீட் த லாங்குவேஜ் டு டெல் அவர் ஐடியாஸ் டு த பீப்புள் பட் இட் இஸ் த ஸ்டோரி தட் ஷுட் கனெக்ட் ஐ வாண்ட் ஐ ட்ரீம் ஆஃப் அ டே வென் வி ஹாவ் ஒன் பிக் ஃபிலிம் இண்டஸ்ட்ரி இந்தியன் ஃபிலிம் இண்டஸ்ட்ரி Tamil, Hindi, Tamil, Malayalam, everything are just languages. We should be the Indian film industry. That's what I want. Uh, that's what I'm striving for. Hello. Sure. Hi. Hi. Good afternoon. This is Akanksha from Film Film at least. Uh, a big congratulations to the, you know, the, mo- the trailer is looking amazing and we can't wait for the movie. The one thing was that when Bahubali came, you know, it took the nation by storm because suddenly Pan India, be- you made Pan India the buzzword. so with rrr coming you have two superstars with you is there more pressure for the superstars as well and for you two to kind of now reach out to a much wider audience and did that w- did that play on your mind that the cinematic sen- sensibilities of the north audience versus the south audience is it different or how was it for you uh 
sensibilities will be different between uh, uh, not just between uh, south and north the sensibilities between tamil and uh, telugu will be different in telugu the sensibilities between telangana and andhra will be different in andhra the sensibilities between east godavari district and west godavari district will be different the sensibilities keep changing just like the tastes of the food that we eat keep changing from area to area but the emotions of a human being never change they are the same across the world so as long as I, my story is based on the basic human emotions that i believe will connect to the uh, connect to everyone i don't worry about how the north indians are going to look at it how the south indians are going to look at it i don't worry about that i just worry about telling my story in the best possible emotional manner possible amazing what about for ram charan and uh, ntr junior i mean absolutely um, thanks to the the previous film he has done bahubali he's erased uh, a lot of the boundaries between the 29 states or 26 yeah, states 29 we states. have uh, 30 states up for 30 we have <laughs> uh, so he's erased the boundaries between all the states and he's made it possible the journey has started with bahubali yes it's still a question whether we are one industry or we are uh, how many other languages we speak in India, we are that many uh, industries. But today I feel he started a journey, not only with RRR and Bahubali, he's also started an initiative himself, which I feel nobody in India, no director in India has started this thought in any of the press, or any of our minds or any of the press's minds to say, please call us an Indian film industry. Wow. And it is started with RRR. I'm very proud. Absolutely. And uh, in Dubai, we are even luckier. You know, they have done the movie in Dolby Vision. And here, we have theatres equipped for that. Thanks to Mr. Ahmed Gulshan here as well. We have great theatres here. I don't think in India, we don't have a Dolby Vision theatre no, yet, right? We no, don't. we don't. Yeah. I think we're going to come back to India, uh, so come back to Dubai. Oh, okay. Dubai to watch. See, we have them here to watch. <laughs> Good evening, sir. Uh, Could we have your uh, opinion as well on this? About the same question. Hmm. Yes. Well, is the mic working? Uh, can I? See, when you have a director like Raj Mohli, as I, you know, I always say this. You know, you just need to do your job as an actor. Your job is not sitting down here and concentrating on how the market is expanding in India or what's happening in different states or different languages or how the sensibilities of the audiences are. Because he's the storyteller, he decides that. As an actor, I believe in one thing. As Raj Mohli said, sensibilities might change, but the emotion always remains the same. So it's, it's, it's just go tap the emotions. I mean, like, you know, when you watch a movie like Avengers, the end game, you know, when you have Iron Man dying, you don't need to have a language there. You just know you already have, you know, you, you have tears in your eyes. Your, your eyes are filled with tears. Call it Dubai, call it USA, call it back in India, call it in a, you know, name even a smallest in the smallest remote village in India. You go show him that scene, he will cry. It's how the story was told by the storyteller and how the actor delivered it. So it's just, we just need to do our job right. That's all right. Thank you, Agamsha. Sure. Good evening, sir. I'm uh, Sham from Radio Gili. Me to Telugu lo ikra matla tan ki chala happy ke ondi anta. We know the great RRR, Mr. Ramcharan, Rajamouli ke aron drama rao karu. I have two questions, sir. One is me idhar ki okay question. Just now, Raja Maligar Jepparu, uh, same, on March 14th, the first time he press meet lo Jepina, Adhe story, how the fiction has happened. Ani. So these three years, how uh, difficult to maintain your physique and uh, the three-hour story ni me entertain jai tani ki, mire three years kasha padaru, how uh, difficult? Ate, man andari te jinde, Raja Maligar, first press meet lo Jepparu, one of it will be one of the fastest uh, movies he's going to make and he really meant it but of course along with everybody we all went through the corona and andro we we all had a pause man andro a pause button nokya adi kevalo rrra pause button nokle so andro pause button nokya so all of us put a pause button so that was the only delay but we've never uh, exceeded in the number of days we initially thought or Rajmali Garu thought we should work. We never had extra uh, schedules happening. 
RRR, the day one press release that happened in Hyderabad, what Rajmali Garu said, it'll be one of the fastest films I will make. It was actually intended and it was, it had happened. But of course, it's only the corona. But keeping that aside, how did we survive? How all of you survived corona, we also survived. <laughs> as simple as that. But keeping our interest, keeping us alive, of course, the man himself, uh, we were interacting, me and Tarak were interacting with him on a weekly basis, sometimes monthly basis. Of course, we want to keep a connect with our director and keep that enthusiasm and that uh, spark alive because all of us suddenly felt unemployed. <laughs> <laughs> unemployed for two years. Yeah. But uh, yes, all of us uh, knew the end result of RRR. So even if I didn't speak to him, weekly basis or monthly basis, my zeal, my thirst to see the end result would have still been alive because I know when I started RRR, with what conviction I started RRR. Rajamali Garu, Miko Kukusin, sir. And with Magadira, Bahubali, RRR, now it's a pan India movie, biggest level of the chest. Uh, my last movie around um, 2017 low release in Bahubali 2, and now we are in 2022, RRR release Kapotundi. Next cinema, how quickly we can see, and uh, we are expecting you an international movie. My Telugu cinema, Indian level, and uh, national movies, ala under Gurthis Naru. So, next movie, Gurinchi. I put a next movie work in the country, yes. <laughs> <laughs> And uh, uh, God willing, uh, and we have uh, fantastic uh, distributors like uh, Mr. Golchin, uh, RRR itself will become an international movie. Thank, Thank you. you. Oh, yeah. Hello, this is Manjusha from Gulf News uh, in Dubai. Uh, lovely to see you guys here and all the best for the film. I just want to know, this is a tale of two rebels, right? At the end of the day. Can you walk me through your rebellious phase in life? And was it for a worthy cause? I hope it was not again for some woman, but yeah, go for it. Try to make something up if you can, but talk about your rebellious phase. <laughs> uh, Mike, Mike. So I think it's better Charan answers the his rebellious journey first and, and then... And he was rebelling back. against India's biggest superstar, Charan Jeevi yeah. <laughs> oh, good. No, actually... Uh, Tarak, a uh, lot of rebels we have, but they have no cause, but he's a rebel with a cause. <laughs> That's why I love him. And uh, he's, a, he's a rebel which is seen. I'm a rebel which is not seen, unseen, whatever you say. So that's why we complement each other. But yeah, I you could say know. I'm the, he's the source <laughs> no, 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 and no. I'm the that end that's point. Not, that's so about I, being rebellious, no, so, yeah, so it's, I, it's he's the source. That's not what I meant. <laughs> <laughs> Only thing you also seen and he's not seen is what it is. Yeah, because he's the he's the starter. He he's, he ignites it. it. I'm glad he lights the fire, of course. But on a more serious note, what are the changes that you saw in director Rajamoli, and how did you, uh, even as a director, what are the changes you, um, you know, you uh, detected in your actors? Because you all started. It's almost like he gave you your first break, really. Absolutely. Put you on the map. No, no, absolutely. I, you know, actually, he gave me the first break. No, yeah. <laughs> yes, that's or what did I said. You, oh, yeah, okay, yes, fine. The actors, yeah, he yes. actually did. I mean, see, nothing has changed in him, but he's become hungrier. He's thirstier. He's, he's in this mode of, you know, seriously, you know, thanks to Rajamali today that we have erased the imaginary boundaries of regional film. And we've become one big film industry. I mean, we're not here endorsing Triple R as a Telugu film, but we're endorsing Triple R as an Indian film, Indian film, and that's happened only because of him. It was his vision of showing the world what Bahubali is. And right now he's in this mode where he's in this complete beast mode. He wants to tell more and more bigger, better stories. All his ideas, he wants to put it in front of this world. And he's hungrier. And, but nothing, his perfectionism is still the same. That will never change. He will never settle down for 99.9. .9. He needs that 100. And he will beg, <laughs> bite, <laughs> kill us if, it's, if he needs to, to get that 100%. And that's what we like in him as a filmmaker. And that's what I think has put him here. I mean, you know, put him where he is today. 
I mean, uh, I mean, uh, my phone. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, we both Tarak and me have come from uh, uh, film industry and uh, film family. But uh, when I did my second film with Rajmouli Garu, Magadira, though I did come from a film family, my father had brought me up <coughs> in such a way, nothing about the industry or the films or the magazines or the awards or any of the pictures, even the fan gave, would ever come into my house. It all stays in the office. So there was no traces of acting or film in or anything. He's never told me when I was starting my first film how to be, how to uh, act, nothing. Even after my first movie, I asked my dad, what do I do better to be a better actor? Trust me, he literally didn't say anything. He really wanted me to have my own journey. That was the moment when I started my first journey with Mr. Raj Moli. Why in repeatedly I keep saying he's my headmaster, he's like a dean in a college. I literally mean it. I have learned so much in my first movie with him. He is a director, he is a master storyteller. At the same time, he is somewhere my mentor, my guru, somebody. I don't know how my dad would feel, but in a way, he has taught me in today's time, when I've realized that what is cinema and everything, he's taught me more than my dad. Oops. Thank you. Namaskaram. Uh, Namaskaram, Chadagari. I'm so excited to see you. I'm so excited to see you. So, yes, uh, SSR, sir. Uh, oh, I'm so uh, yeah. sorry. I'm so, <laughs> sorry. Yeah, I'm so excited. I'm so sorry. Uh, it's okay. Yeah. I'll come back to you. Um, uh, the difference between uh, uh, them, how they changed, uh, obviously it's been uh, years since I worked with them. Obviously the maturity levels have uh, increased. Uh, the naughtiness have come down a, a little really? bit. Uh, but otherwise they are the same. Uh, I always say <laughs> Tarak, uh, I always say Tarak is like a, he's a supercomputer. He's like a sponge who absorbs everything, each and everything. I mean, None of us might remember what is there in this hall after we step out. But if you ask him, he will tell you the what is the color of the carpet, what is the uh, lighting pattern here, what is uh, what water uh, brand of water did we have. He remembers everything. I don't know why he puts everything, but he grabs each and everything. And he doesn't do it consciously. That also reflects in the way he approaches a character. The moment I start narrating a story to him, his characterization to him, I see his brain is already in the functioning of what he needs to do on the day of the shoot. And we are so close and I understand him so much. He understands me so much that he actually knows how I'm going to shoot the, the particular scene or shot. And I also know how he's going to act, where he's going to pause, where he's going to turn his head. I know everything about him. He knows everything about me. So it is a complete joy for me when I place my camera and sit in front of the monitor and see him perform the exact way that I envisioned in my mind. So that's the kind of uh, uh, rapport that I, that I have with him. With Charan, it is uh, completely different. Um, I have been telling this many times. I, uh, the, the, uh, the, the time when I saw, uh, when I saw Okay, the feedback is too feedback. much. Feedback. Can you Can reduce you it a little bit? Reduce the uh, level a little bit. Yeah. yeah, when I saw Rangasthalam, I was, I was completely blown away. Very frankly, I, after doing Magdira with him, my biggest film, his biggest film, I never imagined Charan could be such a phenomenal actor. I didn't believe that. And I was completely blown away. And I was... I was wondering how he was doing that. I didn't know that Charan. I know didn't I didn't know the Charan of Rangasthalam when I did Magdira. So I was wondering how he did it. And when he came to uh, onto the sets of RRR, it was quite a revelation for me because I never seen any actor do that. I heard about it, but I never see. I have never seen. He comes to the set as a completely white blank canvas, and tells the director, "You paint what you were, whatever you want." Uh, on me 
and it is very easy to say that just unclutter your mind but it is it is impossible to ask i cannot do that and i learned that from him i mean i didn't learn but i saw that there is a person in front of my eyes who can do that and he surprised me he surprised me many times that if i imagined that this is what i need from the from my actor he surpassed it he surprised me many times tarak khan surprised me i know everything about him <laughs> but charan surprised me sometimes sometimes it was not what i wanted and i had to bring him to that what i wanted uh, level but sometimes he surprised me gave me more than what i want that's that's the difference between both of them on yeah, to your please. question yes. please <laughs> ఓకే సో చెరి గారు నమస్కారం వెల్కమ్ టు యూ రాజమౌళి సార్ నమస్కారం వెల్కమ్ టు యూ అండ్ తారక్ గారు వెల్కమ్ టు యూ చాలా ప్రేమగా మిమ్మల్ని మనం ఇక్కడ స్వాగతిస్తున్నామండి నేను ఆర్జే కృతిక మీకు ఒక ఎగ్జైటింగ్ న్యూస్ ఇవ్వాలని ఇక్కడ వచ్చాను ఏంటంటే వన్ అండ్ ఓన్లీ తెలుగు రేడియో స్టేషన్ మన యూఏలో వస్తుంది రేడియో ఖుషి అని సో ఒక్కసారి మీరు రావాలి మన అందరినీ కలవాలి వీర్ నాట్ ఎగ్జైటెడ్ సో కమింగ్ బ్యాక్ టు ది క్వశ్చన్ చెరి గారికి మళ్ళీ తారక్ గారికి నా క్వశ్చన్ ఏంటంటే రమ మగధీర నుంచి ఆర్ఆర్ఆర్ వరకు మళ్ళీ యమదొంగ నుంచి ఇక్కడ వరకు హౌ వాజ్ యువర్ వర్క్ షాప్ ఈ ఫిలిం స్టార్ట్ అవ్ అయినప్పుడు హౌ వాజ్ ది వర్క్ షాప్ ప్రిపరేషన్స్ ఎలా ఉండేది బికాస్ దిస్ ఇస్ వెరీ ఇంట్రెస్టింగ్ వెరీ డిఫరెంట్ సంథింగ్ యూనిక్ మనము బిహైండ్లో చేయాలంటే ఇట్స్ అ లిటిల్ యూనిక్ సో వాట్ వాజ్ ద ప్రిపరేషన్స్ ఇన్ యువర్ వర్క్ షాప్ ఐ వాంటెడ్ టు నో సి ఫర్ మీ ఇట్ వాస్ మై ఫస్ట్ వర్క్ షాప్ ఎవర్ never been in a workshop <laughs> while my while uh, while being a part of a movie maha kent ante idi see we did not have see komrum bhim character does not have any virtual references as films alluri sitaram raj gar demo oka reference undi krishna gar chesina tuvanti alluri sitaram raj character movie undi tata gar chese idi unnai but the best part about triple r is it's completely fictitious mm-hmm. if you if you paid attention to what rajmouli you know whenever he gave his look out of his actors he always said my bhim my yes. rama raju he said my sita so it's, it's got nothing to do with what you know about them it is about what you don't know about them and what his idea of showing the world of his characters how he wants to portray them so marco he didn't fill us up with a lot of information he gave us information what needs what we need as actors to play his characters so he gave us details of pro bhim yala tintad how does he eat because bhim yeah you know bhim character is he's he's huge he's he's he's, he's massive so how would he eat what speed would he eat how would he sit down because he's he's a tribal how would he sit down how would he walk how would he drink his water how will he how will he talk to a very learned man so this was the detailing which we were given as actors which really helped us like in in every which way when he gave us the scene you know when we have all these already filled in my mind you know in your mind you automatically you know as an actor you're driven towards what the director needs so it was it was it was very interesting it was my first workshop ever <laughs> right uh cherry garu me ke laund in the workshop how was your experience mike again hi uh, no i don't want to uh, give my perspective both of us have traveled in the same journey together so it's almost the same but uh, always uh, every person evolves a lot every year and likewise uh, rajmouli gar evolved as he's evolving he's helped us also evolve in a m- into terex so that's all i can say uh, thanks to him that we all have evolved so much okay. but otherwise whatever tarak has said exactly that was my journey through rrr very nice very nice uh, sir meek na question entante alia bhat garni manamu uh, we have seen in a very soft character anamata like student of the year uh, hampi sharma kid like a soft character bubbly am i like ikkada it is a little different how did you imagine apart gangubai how did you imagine alia bhat in this character end gun pistin anpinchindi ee ammai kavali ee character ki i mean when i uh, see alia bhat externally she looks like a very fragile very soft girl 
but i don't know how you see it but when i see her i feel like inside that softness inside that fragility there is a very strong willed character that's how i feel when i look at alia i'm not i'm ta not talking about the character she played mm -hmm. when i look at her that's what i feel so that's exactly what i wanted for my sita she should look very soft very fragile but uh, she should be strong enough to reign in these two forces of water and fire right. no that's how i envision and that's why she was there in the film okay one last question for tarak garu meer idaru chaala manchi friends cherry garu meer idaru chaala chaala manchi friends manam andaru excited gunnamo meer idaru mee iddar gurinchi okka chinna secret kaani okka chinna memory mana daggara share chestunte i'm lot excited to know behind the screens okka chinna chinna memory memory about what with about a friendship meer idaru ah friends evandi mee iddaru evvarki prapancham ki teliyakunda happy ga silent ga గుడ్ ఫ్రెండ్స్గా ఉన్నాం ఎవరికి తెలియకుండా ఈ మనిషి వల్ల పూర్తిగా బయటపడిపోయింది అది సో మై మెమరీ ఆర్ ఫ్రెండ్షిప్ మై మెమరీ ఆర్ ఫ్రెండ్షిప్ ఇచ్చారు అండ్ ఐ వుడ్ లైక్ టు కీప్ ఇట్ వెరీ పర్సనల్ ఇట్స్ 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 వెరీ పర్సనల్ టు మీ సో షేరింగ్ అవుట్ మెమరీస్ అండ్ ఇవి ఆర్ ఆర్ దే నాట్ మెమరీస్ ఎనీ మోర్ ఐ థింక్ వాట్ వీ డూ టుగెదర్ ఇట్ బెటర్ బీ పర్సనల్ చాయ్ కాఫీ తాకుతారు కదా యూ గైస్ కెన్ హ్యాండిల్ ఇట్ చాయ్ చాయ్ కాఫీ తాకుతారు కదా ఏంటి చాయ్ లో కాఫీ తాకుతారు కదా కూర్చొని సిట్టింగ్ లేస్ కాని యుల్ సెట్ అండ్ టాక్ ఆల్ దోస్ థింగ్స్ వెరీ వెరీ నైస్ అండ్ ఆల్ ది వెరీ బెస్ట్ వి ఆర్ ఎక్సైటెడ్ టు థాంక్యూ థాంక్ యూ థాంక్ యూ విల్ గో ఇన్టు ఐ థింక్ ఐ కెన్ టేక్ అ ఫ్యూ మోర్ క్వశ్చన్స్ ప్లీజ్ ప్లీజ్ గో ఆన్ యా షూర్ 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 வணக்கம் எயிட்டி நைன் பாயிண்ட் ஃபோர் தமிழ் எஃப்எம்லேருந்து நான் ஆர்ஜி மதுவோ என்னோடய கொஸ்டின் வந்து ராஜமௌலி சாருக்கு சார் இப்போது ரெண்டு மிகப்பெரிய ஸ்டார்ஸ் வச்சு நீங்கள் படம் எடுக்கிறீங்க ஸோ சாதாரண விஷயம் கிடையாது ஆலியா பட் மேமும் பெரிய ஸ்டார் நிறைய ஸ்டார்ஸ் வச்சு எடுக்கும்போது இது பீரியாடிக்கல் ஃபிலிம் நீங்கள் கதையும் காம்ப்ரமைஸ் பண்ண முடியாது பெரிய ஸ்டார்ஸ்க்கு ஸ்க்ரீன் ஸ்பேஸும் கொடுக்கணும் ஏன்னா ஃபேன்ஸோட எக்ஸ்பெக்டேஷன் கண்ணா பின்னாண்டு இருக்கும் ஆஃப்டர் பாகுபலி ஸோ ஏதாவது ஒரு சின்ன காம்ப்ரமைஸ் நீங்கள் பண்ணிங்களா ஸ்க்ரீன் ஸ்பேஸ்க்காகவோ இல்லைனா படத்தோட கதையில் ஏதாவது ஒரு பார்ட்டை கட் பண்ணுறதோ இந்த மாதிரி ஏதாவது ஒரு சின்ன காம்ப்ரமைஸ் வந்து நடந்துதா இவ்வளோ பெரிய ஸ்டார்டம்னால இல்லைங்க அந்த மாதிரி இருக்காது பிகாஸ் த வே அப்ரோச் த ஃபில்ம் இஸ் டிஃப்ரெண்ட் ஏன்னா ஐ டோன்ட் லுக் இன் டேர்ம்ஸ் ஆஃப் ஹவு டு பேலன்ஸ் த ஸ்டார்ஸ் ஹவு டு பேலன்ஸ் த ஆக்டர்ஸ் யூ கேன் பீஸ் இட் ஐ டோன்ட் லுக் இன் ஐ டோன்ட் லுக் அட் த ஸ்டோரி இன் தட் வே அட் ஆல் ஐ லுக் இன் த டேர்ம்ஸ் ஆஃப் ஹவு இன்ட்ரெஸ்டிங் த ஸ்டோரி கேன் பி ஹவு பிகாஸ் ஐ எம் டீலிங் வித் டூ டூ கேரக்டர்ஸ் ஹவு கேன் ஐ மேக் தெம் ஹவு கேன் ஐ மேக் த ஆடியன்ஸ் எம்பத்தைஸ் தெம் ஈக்குவல்லி ஸோ தட் ஐ ஸ்ட்ரகிள் எ லாட் டு bring a balance in that aspect but not in the aspects of uh, equal screen space irka illiya ivar konjam jaasti irukana avaru konjam cut pannalama indi ivar ko or fight vechaana avaru ko or fight vekkalama avarku naaluk punch kodutaana ivarku naaluk kick kodukalama in in the madri balance alla na na panna maten that is okay. that is not how we make a film we make the film in a very engaging manner in that engaging manner if i had to cut out some space i'll cut out some space okay. if i had to increase some space i had to increase that space ultimately it is the story that we are slave to okay yeah that's what i believe thank you thank, thank you. you sir thank you okay there's one in the front and then i'll come back to you sure please please go on uh, hi andy telugu community tarapuna a warm welcome to dubai tarak garu meer antu untaru naaku chaala chanuve ekkuva rajmoudi garu tho ani సో అది మీకు ప్లస్ పాయింట్ అయిందా మైనస్ పాయింట్ అయిందా ఈ సినిమాకి ఈ సినిమాకి అండి ఆ మైనస్ పాయింట్ అనుకోవాలండి కొంచెం అయ్యో అంటే మరి కనికరం లేకుండా ఎస్పెషల్లీ దట్ 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 ఎపిసోడ్ ఫర్ విచ్ వి ఐ మీన్ విచ్ వి షాట్ ఫర్ 65 నైట్స్ ఎగ్జాక్ట్లీ వి స్టార్టెడ్ షూటింగ్ ఫర్ దట్ ఎపిసోడ్ ఇన్ సమ్మర్ దెన్ కేమ్ కరోనా దెన్ వి హాడ్ అ లాక్ డౌన్ and he has and he has this habit of starting off where he you know starting from where he stopped so he started with that episode and it was peak winters yeah he drenched me in water at 4 am in the morning i was shivering okay. and he was the fire right he was pretty happy <laughs> not in summer but <laughs> సో ఒక విధంగా చను మీకు మైనస్ పాయింట్ అయింది ఈ ఒక్క దగ్గర మైనస్ పాయింట్ ఉంది అది ఆ ఎపిసోడ్ ఒక్క దగ్గర ఓకే but it's always a plus point a chanu undadam valla i've grown as an actor and 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 i always say this my growth as an actor today okay. is 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 because of him okay it's it's what he made me realize mana potential manaki teliyad antam kada potential is something which you are not so basically he pushed me to 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 
acha satisfy myself as an actor oh great and not worry about <laughs> the results and box office performances of a movie yeah. you're an actor you do your job perfectly <laughs> thanks sunny thank, thank you thank you and, and uh, uh, one show uh, ramchan garu uh, he tarak eppudu antu untar rajmouli is like a monster ani so meeru magadira chesaru already experience ayipindi aa monstrous evanna increase ayinda rrr ki aina kota evanna penchesara monster idi meere cheppal adi అబ్సూట్లీ అండి మగ దగ్గర కలెక్షన్స్ బాహుబలి కలెక్షన్స్ మీరు చూసారు సో ఆబ్వియస్లీ ఆ మాన్స్టర్ ఇంక్రీజ్ అయ్యింది అండ్ ఐ ఆల్వేస్ సే ఐఎమ్ బెటర్ వెన్ ఐ వర్క్ విత్ మాన్స్టర్స్ ఆర్ వర్క్ అండర్ ప్రెషర్ అండ్ ద అమౌంట్ ఆఫ్ గుడ్ ప్రెషర్ హీ పుట్స్ ఆన్ యాక్టర్స్ ఇట్ డ్రైవ్స్ అస్ టు వేక్ అప్ అండ్ డూ అండ్ గెట్ ఇన్స్పైర్డ్ యాజ్ అన్ యాక్టర్ అండ్ ఆఫ్టర్ దిస్ ఆల్సో యూ గోయింగ్ టు మాన్స్టర్స్ అగైన్ రైట్ Sumar, Shankar, all the rest of the movies yeah, are also we'll, monsters we'll, coming up. We'll talk in the next expo. <laughs> <laughs> so, I'll take one yeah, more yeah. question. I, I, I'm really running out of time. Yeah, please. You are up there. ముందుగా ముగ్గురికి కృతజ్ఞతలు సార్ మాకు ఇలాంటి సినిమా తీసుకురావడానికి ఫస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఆల్ ముగ్గురు రావడం ఇట్స్ అ వెరీ గ్రేట్ థింగ్ విత్ రెస్పెక్ట్ టు ద క్వశ్చన్ సార్ రాజమౌళి సార్ దిస్ క్వశ్చన్ ఇస్ ఫర్ యూ సో దెర్ ఆర్ మెనీ బిగ్ ఫిల్మ్స్ విచ్ ఆర్ మేడ్ ఆల్ ఓవర్ ఆన్ ద వరల్డ్ రైట్ and especially when it comes to a telugu film being made with respect to the constraints of the budget and the technology and the time that you have what you pulled off is a great thing during corona virus i mean thanks a lot for doing this so what i wanted to understand from you was with respect to the technology we use the fact that we are in <laughs> expo so with respect to the technology you use and the, the technology that is used in the western countries how different are we are like how, does that affect the amount of time that it's taking for the film to be produced and coming to the theaters at the end of the day uh, i mean that that's a big question to answer <laughs> it will become a, a master class i think <laughs> instead of being a press meet uh, uh, the work culture is quite different from uh, the western world to uh, to our indian industry uh, simply put a western uh, industries tend to work with less number of people with less number of days in greater output because for them um, uh, that is more money the the human resources cost more so they the, the way they program their whole thing is like they tend to squeeze the film into a lesser number of days the way indians we indians work for every small work we we employ many number of people, uh, people because we are a bigger populous uh, country uh we need to employ more people so even for a small work more number of people come uh actually what happens it uh, happens is with lesser number of people you can get the work faster contrary to the belief that more number of people get the work faster absolutely uh, more number of people tend to make the work slower but that is that is how it's traditionally been not just the film industry traditionally that's how have been how we have been working uh so that's just the working style i'm not saying one is better one is uh, not so better okay and technology wise uh, uh, obviously we get all the technology from the west and they uh, uh, employ it uh, earlier they get better at, at that the technology first and we are always some 5 6 years behind but what we do is uh, what we have a fantastic word in india called jugad <laughs> right <laughs> right we find out things that westerners can't even think of because the necessity necessity is mother of invention absolutely uh, just as an example i can tell you uh, again i'm coming to the same sequence again 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 the interval sequence where it had number of humorous uh, animals uh, in between to to exactly shoot it in a western way would make me will cost me like into millions of dollars to get the equipment to shoot it to, to be precise sure. um, uh, but we went in a completely different way we employed local uh, uh, technology geeks we employed small led lights to trace the paths of the animals wow. and uh, we used rc cars in the place of animals uh, sure. to uh, to move them so no uh, west would do in a completely different way but we did in a completely different uh, way absolutely of course it still cost us a lot of money but the same money would have cost 10x if it was a western way of working so 
I think as an example that will makes a lot of question. sense. Makes a lot of sense. Thank you. So, Thank with you. respect to the actors, I have only one last question, please. Yeah, I so, mean, yeah. So both of you are coming together, right? At any point of time, while you're dubbing for different different languages, did you feel uncomfortable, or did you feel like um, your your uh, syncing wasn't in place, or anything like that, or were you really comfortable with it? Or was it so easy? Yeah, because see, we. it was his intention that uh, we speak in the languages the film is being released in because the emotion is stronger when it's coming from the actor i mean all due regards to dubbing artists who have done great jobs normal jobs but well he felt that it's nice if we can communicate as actors in 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 those respective languages and it was just fun you know it 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 in a way it made us learn the language you know sure. become better in it a little more we had uh, uh, people to help us while we were dubbing for it and 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 yeah you know all these languages are not alienated to us you know telugu is there obviously and tamil, tamil. we know tamil because the film industry the telugu film industry migrated from chennai chennai to 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 hyderabad and we have a lot of tamil speaking technicians and kannada yes because my mom was a Uh, she's a Kannada girl, so it was Kannada was easier for me, and uh, Hindi because we come from Hyderabad, you know, born and brought up in Hyderabad, and Hindi is again is not an alienated language. So it was, it was, it was, it was really good, you know. When, you know, we were happy that we could give our emotions out in that, you know, in that respective language. Except for Malayalam. Except for Malayalam. <laughs> Next time. For Next sure. time. <laughs> so thanks a lot for all all the questions. Yeah. Okay. So, thank you guys. Thanks a lot for being here. And of course, we know that's one man who has made one E, one Eecha a superstar, a fly a superstar. And 550 crore movie, I think first day done. <laughs> so, let's all book our tic tic uh, tickets in advance from 25th. It's going to be showing in all the theaters near you and we get to watch it in Dolby Vision as well. Yeah, so, we hello yeah one thing uh, 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 we are very happy to announce is that we get to enjoy rrr in triple uh, r in many ways you can enjoy it in imax, IMAX. you 3D. can enjoy it in dolby vision you can enjoy it in 3d 3d no. yes and uh, usually i don't go for 3d but why 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 i went to 3d for this time is that it brings the actors closer to the audiences and the emotion is that much more right i felt the emotion coming uh, very close to me sure. so i uh, chose 3d and they're also getting imax 3d yeah, wonderful uh, is, wonderful yeah and many big screen different big screen formats you can enjoy the in uae you can enjoy all the all formats, <laughs> all formats. <laughs> we are lucky <laughs> that way we are lucky that way thanks. and we are lucky to have you guys here as well thanks a lot thanks a lot tarak thanks a lot rajmol garu thanks a lot charan thank you thanks a lot for being here thanks a lot thank you please